Hey, welcome everybody. It's KB here and uh, check this out. This is pretty cool feature that I'm going to show you. I can type using my voice, not using my keyboard. Check this out. Hey, it's me, KB. I think I'm a cool guy who makes cool tutorial, I guess. So you can see as I speak, it is typing itself. And uh, to be honest, I can type faster with my voice <laughs> than my keyboard. So this is like really cool feature that is really useful to me. So yeah, uh, today I'm just going to show you guys how to use this feature and what is this feature and all that. This feature is actually been unknown to me. And recently when I started using the Windows 11, then I knew that there is a, such a feature that you can use your voice to type. So I was like, OK, why? Why not in Windows 10? Actually, it turned out that in Windows 10, there was a feature called online speech recognition. OK, and in Windows 11, it is a improved version and it is called voice typing and it's pretty cool. OK, this is like one of those feature that I never knew, even though I'm a Windows user. But still, I didn't know about this feature, but this feature is very cool. Let me know in the comments. Did you know about this feature when you were using the Windows 10? All right. So first, I'm going to show you guys how to use it in Windows 11. And I'm going to show you how to use it on Windows 10 too at the end of this video. All right. Let's begin. So in Windows 11, uh, to access this feature, you can simply press Windows plus H key at the same time and it will launch the voice typing all right so this is what it's going to look like it's pretty cool uh yeah okay so there is another way to access this just in case if you can't access this like you don't even have a keyboard uh, like you want to use only your voice to type and your mouse what you can do is go to taskbar settings and turn on touch keyboard all right once you turn on the touch keyboard you'll get a touch keyboard icon in the taskbar so simply click on it okay and after that click on mic icon all right and you need to make sure that you are in somewhat of typing space like you are typing actually so you can use this feature all right so you don't have keyboard don't worry you can just use your mouse to access this feature too all right and this is like i don't know about you but i think i can type faster with my voice than keyboard yeah i'm really slow with keyboard and this is like really cool feature <laughs> that i recently discovered okay not a big deal but i'm one of those people who didn't know about this okay so in keyboard just press the mic icon and after that start speaking just like that okay Hey, what's up? It's me, KB. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, this is like the second way to access this. And the first way is to just press Windows plus H key, just like that. Hey, what's up? It's uh, nobody here and uh, I'm typing using my voice. I don't want to use my keyboard because I'm slow with my keyboard. So, yeah. Uh, okay you got the idea here okay so if you're good at speaking it's it's gonna be really good and time saving you know feature and there is an extra feature in windows 11 if you use windows 11 and use this feature when you launch the voice typing uh, feature click on the settings and after that click on auto punctuation which will automatically insert uh, commas uh, full stops and everything uh, let me give you the demo here okay you can turn it on uh, yeah <laughs> if you're a good in English speaker it's gonna be like 100 time faster than your keyboard yeah hey what's up it's KB here so you can see um, there is a comma, there is a question mark, there is a everything. 
full stop and everything. So this is like really cool feature of Windows 11. Uh, you can also do it in Windows 10. So let me show you how to do it in Windows 10. All right, we are in Windows 10. Uh, the keyboard shortcuts are same. You just need to press Windows plus H key. And after that, if this online speech recognition is not turned on, you need to click on the settings, go to settings and turn it on. All right. And this is the settings you can do for the voice typing in Windows 10. That's all we have, all right? It's not as fancy as in Windows 11. It's pretty simple, straightforward, but works, but works, okay? Hey, what's up? It's uh, KB here and uh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah, you can see it, it works, okay? Yeah, as I speak, it just writes. So, same thing as the Windows 11, but in Windows 11, it is improved a little bit, right? And uh, if you don't have keyboard to press Windows plus H key, it's easy in Windows 10, right click and click on show touch keyboard button, okay? Just click on that. And after that, you should see a microphone icon at the top actually it's a little bit different in windows 10 compared to windows 11 so if you don't have a keyboard to press windows plus h key this is what you're gonna do all right just click on it and after that start typing so make sure that you are actually typing <laughs> you know you need something to type okay so hey what's up it's kb here Yay, look at that. <laughs> so, yeah, this is like really cool feature that everybody should be using. Uh, actually, not everybody. If you're good at like keyboard, good for you. If you're not good at keyboard, but you speak really well, this feature is awesome. Okay, this feature is awesome to type anything. Yeah. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions related to this feature, then you can do the comment in the comment section below and uh, I'll try to help you out. All right. And that's it. If you have any suggestions, you can also do the comment. Yeah, I'm a pretty cool guy who makes tutorial. All right. <laughs> that's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye bye.